Hey guys, William with Create Studio, and in this video I'm going to show you how to replace your character audio inside your character explainer videos. All right, so the first thing I want to do is show you how to replace the dialogue using your own voice. All right, so let's go into our second scene here, and I'm going to go ahead and double click in here, and it will show you all of the assets that are available inside of this group. Now I'm looking for the original audio right here, this text to speech has already been recorded. I'm going to select this and hit delete. All right, so now I'm going to navigate to my media. And I have a pre-recorded file that I recorded here inside of Create Studio. And again, if you don't know how to do that, all you need to do is go to our music section. And if you go to record, it'll bring up our recording. And then you can choose which recording device you want to choose from and then record that straight in. And then you can then import that file into your session by going to media. And then we can drag this dialogue that I've already recorded into my canvas here. And then here it goes. It popped in right here at the top. So what I want to do is I want to line up my dialogue with the spot that I want him to start talking at, right? So he comes in off screen and then he starts talking about the history, mission, and vision of the company, right? So I've got a line similar to that. And then I'm going to go ahead and have him come in and start walking. And then he'll start talking about right here. So I'll drag my VO right to the cursor there at the spot that I've lined up. And then now what I can do is right click on my audio track and then click on sync with Tom. And so now when I play this back, Learn about our history, mission, and vision, and what sets our company apart. All right, so that's a great way to tap into your own voice and really make it your own, and you can customize it to what you want it to say, right? All right, so now let's look at a couple more examples. All right, so let's go ahead and pick a scene here, and I want to replace the audio for this lady here. So the first thing I want to do is I need to generate some audio for some text that I already have. So I'm going to go to my music section. I'm going to go to speech, and under my AI, I'm going to generate some really awesome audio here. So I'm going to paste in my script and I can choose my different voices by selecting on these voice options here. And you can choose between male voices and preview them or female. Um, I've already got some favorites here. So let's go ahead and choose this one right here. All right. And then I'm going to go ahead and generate my speech and it's going to go ahead and generate that and then produce an audio file for me, right? So I could preview it here. Smart business solutions leverage advanced technologies and data analytics to streamline operations and drive efficiency. All right, now I can import that into my media. And so what I can do now is I need to connect that audio file with this current character. So I'm gonna go double click inside this scene and then I'm gonna scroll until I find her text to speech, right? So let's go ahead and zoom in a little bit here so we can see what we're working with. And what I'm gonna do is I'll put my cursor at the point at which the audio starts, which is right here. And I will delete this line, this current one. And then let's go ahead and drag in this guy so it starts about right there too. All right. So now I've got her speech in there and I can right click on it and I'm going to say lip sync with Lenka, right? So now I've already lip synced it. So now if I play it back. Smart business solutions leverage advanced technologies and data analytics to streamline operations and drive efficiency. All right. So we have successfully replaced her audio for this character. So now let's go and replace it for one more character just so we can really get these steps down. All right, so I'll go back to my main timeline and then let's kind of go forward a little bit here to the next scene. And I'm going to replace his current dialogue with something that I want to kind of recreate. So again, I'm going to go into my music section under speech and I'm going to paste in my new text here. And then I'm going to go up here and again, you can search for different characters. So if you have a male character, you can search for and listen through all the different variety of options you have. Um, I'm going to go to some of my favorites here and let's go to this guy right here. All right, so now I'm going to go ahead and hit generate speech. And then once it processes it out, it will then create a preview for me, which I can then play. We prioritize building strong relationships and going above and beyond. All right, and then so now I can import that into my media and drag that into where my new scene is. So let's double click on my scene here and let's go ahead and zoom in so we can see what's going on. And let's scroll down until we find our speech. So here is our spot where the speech starts. So I'm going to delete that old speech there and drag in this new one. And let's fire that off about right there. And so now I'm going to right click it and then click on sync with Tom. And then now when I play this back, we prioritize building strong relationships and going above and beyond to meet the needs of each individual. All right. So now we've successfully synced his audio with our new character in there. All right, so that is how you can replace your audio files inside of character explainers. It's a very simple, straightforward process, but your options are very endless for all of the projects and the needs that you may have. Hopefully you got some really cool, quick tips out of here. Can't wait to see what y'all create. I'll catch y'all in the next tutorial.